matter where you look in financial markets, it is crystal clear we are living today in a very, very different world. We were the global financial centre. We had brand Britain in our hands. And I think there's absolutely no doubt that people are very distressed uh, at the damage that they feel we've unnecessarily done to ourselves and to Europe. The UK is still a great place to do business, but this sort of fog of uncertainty in terms of our relationship uh, with the EU and indeed the rest of the world is going to last uh, for a while. Will uncertainty make the UK simply too risky for the long term? Projects. If you have money elsewhere in the world, you know, the UK looks like a very attractive place to acquire assets. The Bank of England and the Treasury have between them many tools to influence the economy. Their toolkit is bigger than ever before. The monetary tools, low rates, QE, in my view, are nearly played out. If we don't start pressing off the monetary and onto the fiscal, that rebalancing is simply not going to occur because you have to get wage growth going somehow. And actually, it's the government that has to do that. The whole paradigm, the global financial architecture, that's what's the problem. Even if from a political perspective you don't mind the bankers losing their jobs, you certainly should mind the fact that you might lose 10 billion of taxation and revenue. What should a good Brexit feel like? Something that disrupts the market <coughs> the least. So we want passporting and equivalents. I think we also need to sort of guard against the sort of apocalyptic scenarios and, and hysteria. Um, I think there will be an agreement with the EU. The question is really how good is it going to be? Now is the time for boards and, and for companies to really understand their supply chains. We don't seem near a crisis at the moment. I actually anticipate we will have an election uh, within a year or so. Business has to work with government and we have to rebuild our brand. I think it's important that we all, and Lloyd's all try to play his part in this, make sure that Britain remains an outward-looking global trading nation. <laughs> <laughs>